This is my own screen. Everybody always try to clean up themselves. That's why you feel for sad. Come me and say when me feel for sad. That's why you feel for sad. Hey guys, happy, happy, happy new year. I know I, I took a break after Vlogmas because Vlogmas lit me for six. Um, I'm actually at work and I'm actually on my lunch break, obviously. And I'm just taxed them as usual because you know I'm not going anywhere. I'm about to have one sauce, cheese sandwich, peanut butter. We're in January and we've hadn't had a snow. We we hadn't had a snowstorm. We haven't had a bit of snow apart from the the flurries I showed you guys the other day, which was like a half an hour type thing. Christmas, no white Christmas. Like it was my first Christmas being spent here that I haven't had snow. I kind of feel some kind of way like Christmas up here without snow as I said before it's not Christmas but anyway I did enjoy my Christmas as you guys saw um we don't have no snow at all New Year's Day no snow the place like Christmas Day was like 50 something degrees in Connecticut like what what it was it, it was just crazy but um today day in January, the place started getting a little bit colder. In December up to November, like we didn't have a under 20 degree weather at all, at all. And today is 19 degrees. So I feel a little cold and we're expecting a snowstorm starting tonight around eight o'clock and go right through to tomorrow. We're expecting to have at least 12 inches of snow. So that's one whole foot of snow. And I'm not looking forward to it because it's not Christmas. Like what? Then it's Christmas and I'm home and you can snow. But not when I need to come to work because nobody not closed from nowhere. The place is going to be open. So we're expected to come to work tomorrow. That's not fun. But yeah. So I will show you that. But guys, just know it's coming out of the building. And I saw they start salting the, the, the ground. And me, <laughs> I thought it was snow already. I'm like, no, it's not supposed to start yet. Like, but anyway, calm down, Marilla says it's actually, it's actually salt. So, anywho, how are you guys doing? I hope you enjoyed your holidays. I hope you have, you had a wonderful Christmas. And I hope you step into 2024 with um, your hopes and dreams expected to be fulfilled this year. The fact that you stepped over, you have life. That's already a big plus right there. So, so thank God for that. Oh, hallelujah. Yes. No, ha hallelujah. Yes. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank God. So my family is well. I hope yours as well as well. This year I don't have, I'm not going to talk about what I'm expected to have, what I'm expecting to happen this year. Like no hopes, no dreams, no changes, no nothing. Um, none of that. I'm realized when we talk about that and when you talk with your dreams and stuff, I already told you guys that people bad mind you and they talk bad about you and it and it not happen. That's what I believe. So I'm not gonna talk about it this year. And plus I feel like when I make um when I talk about things and when I set all these expectations, eventually it doesn't happen and then it get demotivated and just stressing. So this year I have some things in my head. Um and I think it's the same thing that I thought about last year, but I'm not gonna say it. I'm just gonna do it on the quiet. And if you guys see anything that have changed versus what I did last year to what I'm doing now, comment on the comment section throughout the year. And let me know if you have seen changes. But I have a couple dreams, a couple changes that I wanna make. Not changes, but just wanna see different results. If that makes sense. If you haven't already subscribed, please go ahead and subscribe, like this video, share this video, and drop a comment under the comment section. Yeah. So I'm gonna go eat this. I'll come back. All right. Yeah. 3:28 a.m. All right, guys. I just woke up. As you can see, outside is white. As you saw. Woke up a good one now. Um, I'm about to go get ready because 
guess the plan is um, we're supposed to get a call from our job to see if we're close. So obviously I'm gonna receive a call and I haven't received a message from my boss. So I mean that work is still in session. All said is why um, my husband just woke up and he's outside cleaning the um, the porch and the driveway so I can actually go to work and cleaning a car. So we're so thankful for him. Um, yeah, so I'm gonna go take a shower right now and I'll drive in the snow to work. So I'll see you in a minute. Okay. All right. All right, guys. So I'm in the car. I'm about to leave out. I'm gonna put on my um my time because it's still snowing outside. But yeah, let's go to work. I still haven't received a call to say that we're not working. So, husband just reminded me to make sure. But I'm taking my time to go to work, um, regardless, because I have a four-wheel drive. Is that regardless of the four-wheel drive, the place is not power or anything. So make sure you're taking your time to go around the corner, um, even though you're still my slide. But yeah, let's go to work. Guys, look how me look like Eskimo. <laughs> oh, sad, it's still snowing. I'm on my um, 15 minutes break. Oh my God, it's snowing for me. And look for my glasses. So it's still snowing outside. Still snowing, not a lot of people came to work today. I think on my team, I have like four that came, one person came late, so like five, but not a lot of people came in today, so. Let me show you what it said looking like since I popped my car like almost three and a half hours ago. Look, this is my windscreen, and I can't really wipe it right now because I have my windscreen up as you guys saw this morning. But yeah, this is outside. I'm not even trying to wipe this off right now. Like I'm not. Mm. -mm. As people always say, can I just clean their windshield? I'm not doing that right now. So. I want to say this. They have a myth that when it snows, it's colder than normal. It's not cold. When it's snowing, it's not cold, as cold. It's when it's finished snowing that you actually get the real effect of that coldness. Because yesterday was like 19 degrees. This morning or right now is like 20 something degrees, right? And it's snowing. But the reason why you bundle up so much is because you don't want to get sick. So like, obviously snow is falling in your head and whatever. I need the snow boot because you don't want to fall and the snow is so high. You don't want to soak and wait up yourself. So that is why we are dressed so thick. Well, this is my regular jacket I normally wear to work. So when it's cold. So I don't have anything different um, except for my time that I wore because it's still snowing. And my snow boots, I don't know if I want to see my snow boots. So I have on my snow boots which is very snowy right now. I have to get on simpler one because it's too fussy for work. But I got my snow boots on and then I got my sneakers that I brought differently. So that is inside, I just changed that off um, because I'm not walking around in this for the whole day in the warehouse. If you don't know, I work in a distribution center as a supervisor. So I'm not walking around in the building like that for the whole day. It is very uncomfortable and I'm walking for like 12 hours. And every day I do over 18,000 steps. So. We ain't doing that. It's not as cold. It's cold, but you know, cool, cool, like extremely cold because it's snowing. After this, tomorrow is when it's going to be cold because then that is when the snow is going to be thawed out or trying to be thawed out, depending on the whatever. So that is when the cold effect actually happened because the ice that dries out. You understand? As you can see everywhere around me, white. Right? It's, it's crazy. Um, and it's not going to stop until around, until what time? Until three o'clock this evening. 
not sure what today's results gonna look like but right now it's not looking so good and this morning this morning when i was coming in the fastest i drove was 16 miles per hour the place was not plowed when i came out the plow man they were just coming out so therefore today was the worst in my town because normally they're on top of their thing they're just cleaning as the snow fall them just clean off but now everybody else had to clean up themselves i'm not doing that shit right now but yeah so um this morning when i came out the road was a mess like i have to be driving in the tracks that other drivers had already drove in you know not to slide past the part of the place like yeah i'm gonna have um four wheel drive let me show you so i drove on this this morning snow that's what i drove on this morning all right but when i tell you that luckily i had this car i drove i drive a 2018 honda pilot and so it's high luckily because with the way how the road actually um looked this morning i regret car couldn't come through that mm -mm. the road was a mess i think the only air that was blowed was actually the freeway so when i touched the freeway to come to work i could do like a 30. touching the corners going around the corners driving through it was a hot it was a hot mess uh, it was not good but anyway we're making it to work on time and my partner didn't even come in so it's not like some contract worker <laughs> wait all supervisors have to wear this all management has to wear this color and then um the associates now have to wear yellow so before we never have where we have to wear no um safety vest but now we have to wear safety vest on the floor yeah so yeah i mean i'm a safety vest <laughs> But anywho, I want to stack on something because it's almost time for me to go back inside and I haven't eaten anything yet because I'm here talking to y'all. So I guess I'll see you on my lunch time. Alright. Okay. A heart speed to the city streets. We begin to feel the fire. We rise like so buildings. As the chemicals they take us higher The night's young And it's just begun and she The next day Guys, this is what I woke up to this morning The snow is falling off the tree It's like a winter wonderland Yesterday couldn't open. Last night when I was coming home, it couldn't open. It couldn't open at all. Here, put it, put it, Stop. You want me to recover it? Make sure not to stop on the foot. That time I'm running. All right, guys, it's the next day. Taking the kids to school, it's a Monday. They had a two hour delay. So it's now 10.27, which we're early. I'm moving on a little bit earlier, which means that school is starting at 10.40. It's now 10.27. Be careful, cause yeah, you had a it's a lot of snow. Yeah, it's a lot of snow. Oh, shit. I forgot to um put it in. Snow drives. Oh my, be careful because it's slippery. Because uh -huh. his eyes are on the floor. His eyes on the road. So guys, it's a lot of snow. It's a lot of snow. 
But hey, we are taking the kids to school. We're taking our time. The roads are a little cleaner than what we saw yesterday, obviously. Yeah, but yeah. it is slushy, mushy ice. on the road. And you have some um, like ice, like it has hardened on some part of it. So just taking my time and going through. Ew! He's dirt and snow. Huh? Yeah, when the dirt itself makes it the snow, that's when it looks horrible. All right guys, so I'm back home, drop off the kids. We were early. It would be really bad if I was late when we actually had a two hours today. So we were early, we went to school. It's now sometime after 11. I'm about to go get some food to eat. Um, Mother-in-law sent over some fish yesterday. So I'm gonna redo that fish, you know how I do it. It's not so cold outside today. It's actually, it started off at 19 degrees this morning when I woke up, but Right now it's like 35 degrees feel like 21. The only thing that's making it feel a little bit cold, as I explained before, is the fact that the ice is melting from the snow and um, the wind. So with all of that happening, that's why it's feeling a little bit colder. But yeah, it's not extremely bad. I'm looking and I'm seeing where we're supposed to get snow again. Not tomorrow, Tuesday, but next Tuesday and Wednesday. I don't think it's gonna be as drastic as this one, but Snow is coming. January the Gwamet itself. There's also a flood watch warning that's coming. That's out for tomorrow, Tuesday, right now. So we're getting rain tomorrow. So that's going to melt off all of the snow. But January the Gwamet itself, like December and November, had no snow, no type of weather. As I said before, Christmas was like a 50-something degrees weather, which is more like a fall, um, spring coming up weather. And January just start with a bang. Like it just snow right um, immediately. Flood warning, all these things. Like it's my month and I'm looking forward to my birthday. Well, yeah, I'm excited for my birthday. Last year I didn't really do anything, but this year I'm not even sure if I'm gonna be doing anything, but it's my birth month. And so I'm always like January is the best month ever, but January they're going itself right already. Like just coming a little bit, no Mr. Winter. But anywho, that's a wrap. Oh, my nails. I should, I'm supposed to be doing my nails this Wednesday, but it don't really look like it want to be done. So I feel like, I don't know if I want to chance it and do it next Wednesday, since my birthday is going to be closer to that time frame. I feel like I can go one more week. Yeah, I feel like I'm going to have it go one more week. I don't know. I don't really want to go anywhere right now in this cold, snowy thing but let's see by tomorrow i'll make my decision and i will either call them and cancel or i don't know but yeah guys thank you so much for watching i hope you're having a wonderful new year so far um if you haven't already subscribed go ahead and subscribe like this video comment and let me know how your new year has started so far if you have any new year resolution um stuff like that and until next time guys that way you feel for
Come here, say when me feel for sad. Say where you feel for sad.